Okay, we want to welcome you back to Castlevania. You might be wondering why have you uh, changed shirts? And it's like the reason is because I've tried to do this guy before, and he was just too difficult. So I'd go back get some light magic and. Um, HP, and uh, we're gonna try to find him again. damage might just be sort of checkpoint too because I will make sure I get to the second phase with a decent amount of HP because the idea is that for the first part I just want to um I want to get to the second phase with enough you know, HP so I can take a couple days but I don't know how far so what I think I'll do is I'll just like make sure I have half HP. Oh dear. Yeah, so I'm gonna be quite the stickler thing about starting from checkpoint. I have to be careful though, because my uh I don't think I want to get into the nasty feedback where I just restart every time I take a hit. Yeah, see, because normally I would have restarted right there. That's okay though. So, yeah, we're going to try and save our magic for the uh, second and third phases of this. Can we dodge that? Oh, 
actually think I'm gonna pause and drink some tea. Hey, yeah, this is gonna be a long episode, so I just wanna make sure you get this done. Drink some tea. Mm. Delicious tea. And then we're gonna drink, or wash down the tea with some water. Perfect. And yeah, this is the form I got to... Uh, last time. And I couldn't do it. So this is what's gonna take me a few times. To do. And basically my idea is I'll use Shout Magic on this form. And then I can use Light Magic on the final form. Yeah, I just thought, because I was doing this Friday and I was like, okay, I can't quite do it. Because I didn't have enough HP and I had zero light magic, so I was like, alright. Okay, no, we're dead. Alright, that's fine though. But now, because I have a lot more HP, a full thing of light magic. Well, I almost a full thing. And, like, shadow magic, I think this is gonna be much easier. Like, let me tell you, this was, uh, something else. This was a, uh, a test in, uh, patience. I think I'm being a little bit too aggressive with the shadow match. And again, this might be a very long episode. I'm hoping not. But weird things have happened. Oh dear. Alright. Look at that. He's chaining up his combos, guys. So I think what happens is I'm mashing the X button a little bit too much, but then I don't have an escape plan. Yeah, I should I should really work on uh, just doing a single jump. Side, he's almost uh, at a second form. Yeah. Oh dear. So I watched the uh, I watched a video on the internet about like some guy doing this on Paladin difficulty. So I'm only doing this on hard. So people have done this on higher difficulties. And uh, yeah, I think I have a better idea of when. Uh, Yeah, I do that, and then I was like, I kind of accept my fate that we're already, like, kind of committed. And we can use light magic if I think I need to. But I'm going to try really hard just to make sure I can do just foul magic. Because I want to save my light magic for the final form. Because that's going to be the hardest. Like, by far and away. Good, 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 good. Oh, 
This is gonna be difficult. But now that we got here, I feel a lot better. Oh no! Thank you, game, for telling me to avoid fighting with Dairy Farmer. I was willing to accept my fate there. And again, if this might be a half hour long video. I'm committed to do this all in one, because I already made the thumbnail for this. So basically we know once we get down to about a quarter of uh, Oh dear. See, now the problem, like, now that I've already beaten with just Shao Man, I know it's, uh, it's possible and I'm gonna keep trying for it. Dang, we almost had him too, one time. So obviously I think I need to consider that every time I um, play up to his face. That's when he does his uh, anti-air attacks. Well, to be honest, he might be doing the same thing because there's some guy jumping around his back at you. It's just like, well, I want him to not do that. Okay, so I think what we need to do, we like jump, hit him once or twice, and then just like get out of there. So not right there because that's uh, eyes already committed. Perfect. All right. Okay, I think this is a lot smarter. Yes, do that, please, please. Whee! All right, we had our fun. All right, and that one I willingly ate the damage, so I claim. Okay, get out of there. Oh dear. That one, oh man. As I was gonna say, for that one, I'm gonna blame the fact that I was just on the edge. Yeah, so I think, uh... There you go, okay. Yeah, not going in ham is probably a better idea. So once you hit, wait. Oh man, so if we get hit, we, we die. That is scary. Play 
very cool place. No hits, get out. So the more damage we don't take, the better off we're gonna be. Oh dear. Too late. And I think if we are gonna get hit, we just need to commit to making his life miserable. Alright. We're close. There we go. Oh, we are one hit away. Alright. See this is better. Now we're gonna consistently get to him throwing javelins. Now this is the final form. I'm gonna reward myself some tea. Oh my goodness, delicious tea. And some water to wash down the tea. Mm. Excuse me, there we go. So he's now... Faster, stronger, more evolved. So this is might actually be like the part where I just like I can't do it. Like honestly, if he didn't have the speed increase, I'd be really confident in my ability to. And this is why I want to save the light magic, because we're going to need it for this part. Because beforehand, if we used light magic, I just don't think we'd have to use it for Can we use fairies on him? Would that stop him? Yeah. 
And then obviously once we run out of white magic, we'll shut up. So I think our strategy will work. It's going to be tight, though. Look at that. We almost got, like, half HP back. Here, let's actually use up the child magic first. Oh, my goodness. Nope. Back to light magic. Oh, man. How about... How about back to not getting hit? Oh, we actually with a lot of the light magic. That was uh, really bad. So I don't know if you guys know this, but if I jump, or if I use the uh, Sephiroth Soldiers when I jump, that actually is like a light magic attack, and it uses quite a bit of light magic energy. Which sucks because um, we want that for healing, and because the uh, the flash of light doesn't actually hurt him. So if I die, I'm actually gonna fully blame uh, that. He is so close to dead, though. Boy, did we do it? We did it! It was only 23 minutes. That's not bad. To your world now. It will be reduced to ashes, and I shall inflict ten times the pain and suffering that were inflicted upon me when I was imprisoned by your brotherhood. <laughs> I'll let you leave. So you can witness your complete and utter. Oh my goodness, I'm making a mess of myself.
there we go. That's how uh, Gabriel became a vampire. And that's how he got his powers. There you go. We defeated the forgotten one. Yay! Me! I did it. We used up all of our shadow and light magic. But hey, that's okay. Um, And yeah, that's it for Castlevania. There is nothing left to do. Like, look at that. Everything's done. So, um, obviously, this is a camp off the series. I had a lot of fun doing this. I'm a little bit sad that it's over. Uh, there is a second game in the series, which I will definitely do at some point. But I'm thinking next up is going to be The Evil Within. But, um, you know, we'll see. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. And um, I'll see you guys next time. And until then, bye.